Yeah, 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 yeah. Whoa, whoa, uh, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's go. Yeah, these scriptures save my life. That will never change. That will never change. Every single day I strive to see them heaven's gates, to see them heaven's gates, yeah, yeah. Yeah, these scriptures save my life. That'll never change, that'll never change, no, no. Every single day I strive to see them heaven's gates, to see them heaven's gates. You know the promises of Christ, because you say you believe in it. What are they? If you believe in Christ, it means you believe in what Christ promised you. What are the promises of Christ? I think I know. I know what you're talking about. It starts with an R. Yeah, yeah I know what you're talking about. I know what you're talking about. It's all good. I know what you're talking about. It's like Irish I understand. I understand. Yeah, 26. You know what I want. Go ahead. The book of Revelation, chapter 2, verse 26. One more time. Read it again. The book of Revelation, chapter 2, and verse 26. Read it out. Go ahead. And he that overcometh. What it say? And he that overcometh. He that overcometh. The letter, what color is the letters? Red. What? Red. One more time. Red. It's red. So that means who's speaking? If the letters are red in the Bible, who's speaking? The letters are red. Like, if, if it's red in the Bible, who's speaking? I, I'm going to assume God that I don't know. I'm going to tell you. I'm telling you. If you. Whenever you open the Bible and see the red letter, it means Jesus Christ is speaking. All right. Right? So, so the people understand who's speaking in the text, right? So read on. Read from the top. And he that overcometh. He that overcometh. This is what Christ promised. Read on. And keeping my works unto the end. Uh -huh. To him. Will I give power over the nation? What do you say? To him will I give power over the nation. One more time. To him will I give power over the nation. So just that part right there. Christ is promising. Whoever overcomes the trials and tribulations, he's going to give you power over the nation. Do you want power over the nation? But do you want what Christ is promising? If you can trust me with that, I'm Okay, let's see what else he says. Go ahead, go ahead. And he shall rule them. What does it say? And he shall rule them. Go ahead. With a rod of iron. Uh huh. You're gonna rule over the nations. What power? Read on. As the vessels of a potter. You're gonna take this iron rod. Christ is gonna give you and do what with it? Shall they be broken to shepherds? And you're gonna smash those nations that you have power over with a rod of iron. Do you want that? I, I like just. But do you want it though? Do I want Christ to smash nations? No, I don't. No, no so you don't. Just because he gave it to me, I don't need to use it. What's your name? Peter, to ask me if I want that. Do you want the rod to crush other nations? Absolutely. That's Absolutely. right. I want power over That's nations it. because every nation has oppressed the so-called 12 tribes of Israel, which are the so-called black Hispanics, con, 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 black con, Hispanics con, con, indigenous con, con, con. Indians. These so, are the 12 so. tribes of Israel, and they've been oppressed. And Christ oh, promised me that if I overcome the tribulations and trials of these last days, I'm going to have power to oppress your people. Because I don't that's, like that. You know what that is? So. You know what that is called, John? Just believe. Just, you, don't, you don't have to agree with that, yeah. but understand. That's something called, with a capital letter J, justice. You know why? Come follow me right here. Come follow me right here. Look what happened to the so-called Negroes that got brought here to America. Oh, well, there's a lot of people that had a bad time. But, but, we're, but. it's me and you, Carmen City, though. My ancestors went, came over here in slavery. All right. Your ancestors were the ones who brought them over here. Right. My, my ancestors fought in the wars. So, like, so they, okay, uh, so they, I'm happy that you know that it was your ancestors who did it. Now, follow me over here. Follow me over here. Follow over here. Look at this one right here. Before they came over here, before the niggas came over here, look what you did to the Hispanics and indigenous Indians. Yeah, I'm talking about your ancestors. You remember you said your ancestors were following orders. No, they, no I didn't say that. I, just said, that. I said they fought in wars. Huh? They fought in wars. Okay, so they fought in this war to oppress these people. That's what happened. King David fought in Huh? King 
in for, for his people. They yeah. didn't want to fight. He so happened to be I'm there. Wait, 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 I'm gonna have a good time. Wait, wait Peter. You, you want to like hang out? I read one verse before you did them. What? I, I will read one verse to see if you believe. I'll listen. I'll listen. What? Read Revelation chapter two, verse ten. And here, I'm gonna read this verse. Let me see if you believe. The book. This is the word of God here. I'm not saying this. It's the word of God. I, I, I actually believe in the Bible. Okay. I believe there's different translations, but it's similar. It's similar. The book of Revelation, chapter 13, verse 9. Oh, no. if, One more time, read it again. The book of Revelation, chapter 13, verse 9. Read it if any man have an ear. If any have ears. I, I do. Currently. Yeah, ears. Go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. Let him hear. Uh huh. What it say? So if you have ears, let him hear. Read on. He that leadeth into captivity. What it say? He, he that leadeth into captivity. One more time. He that leadeth into captivity. He that leads into captivity. Read on. Read, read. Shall go like into for example, captivity. I take your hand and I forcibly take you somewhere that you don't want to go. Oh, I like the right? cops. Right. 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 Lead like cops. Right. Yeah, absolutely, Peter. Okay. Go ahead. He that leadeth into captivity. He that leadeth into captivity. Come on. Like, shall go into captivity. Shall what? Shall go, go into captivity. Shall what? Shall go into captivity. Go into captivity. Like Judas like kisses so, around the cheek. No, it's not even like that. It's like this. The same way the so-called Caucasians took us and forcibly brought us to America to work and die, to sell drugs on these streets, to struggle, to all these yeah, things, and be killed. There's drugs that are for, that are planted White in our nation. Well, no, 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 no. Drugs, you're right. But drugs are, are severely planted within our neighborhoods where drug dealers take, sell, cons 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 what's the word I'm looking for? Confiscate. Confiscate, Confiscate yeah. these drugs, and then somehow they magically end up back on the streets again. How that happen? Huh? Read that scripture one more time. Corruption and crime since huh. the beginning of time. The book of Revelation chapter 13 verse 9. Uh -huh. If any man have an ear, uh -huh. let him hear. Uh -huh. He that leadeth into captivity. He that leads into captivity, read on. Shall go into captivity. Shall what? Shall, shall go, go into, into captivity. captivity. Shall, shall, shall go, go into captivity. Shall go into captivity. And you agree, you agree with this verse, right? I don't agree with your interpretation that I think you're pushing on me. Okay, right. how about this? Before you leave, Peter, please don't read it. You, you explain it. Read that verse. God, Revelation 13, verse 9. Uh huh. No. If any man have an ear, let him hear. Uh huh. He that leadeth into captivity uh -huh. shall go into captivity. Go ahead. Sword. This one he sword along. Okay, what did they do to the Hispanics? Did they have guns? The guns? I, I, I think everybody should have guns. Wait, no, 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 no. Let's talk about people having guns. Hold on, you misinterpreted what I just said. Did the, when, it, when the Spanish conquistadors came over here to Maybe kill the indigenous guns, indigenous they indigenous shoot Hold on, hold on, Peter. If the, if the Spanish conquistadors, when they came over here, did they have guns to kill the indigenous Indians? They had guns. Yeah. No, they didn't. No, the Spanish and Cuban didn't have that. Right. They had the halberd, they had the uh, sword. That's what they had. Right. Read well, it one more time. Cool. He that leadeth into captivity uh -huh. shall go into captivity. Uh -huh. He that killeth with the sword uh -huh. must be killed with the sword. Uh -huh. So this is, this is justice. Hold on, Peter. I'm just telling you straight up. This is justice for us as so-called black and Spanish slave practices. Come on, you can't tell me you look, you can see this and tell me these people don't deserve justice? Have America done no, everything everybody, to pay us back? Wait, let's not talk about I a lot of people. I We're having a conversation here. I am. I, have, I understand, I understand, Peter, but have these people ever got paid back by America for what happened to them? Come on. I don't know the whole situation. Oh, Actually, you don't know the situation? I'm not an accountant. I'm not an accountant. Wait, 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 put your hand but down. I'm, put your hand down. Calm down. But the question is, oh, I'm right, actually I'm like, saying, I'm just saying, they, like, have they got paid back? There's a good show here. Oh, wait, 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 wait Peter, point. Peter, right. have they got paid back or not? I, look, all right, it's not my responsibility. It's not your responsibility. And okay. you know why? You know why you feel like that? You know what? I want to test you. Do you at least feel bad to what happened to these people? Yeah, of course. I feel bad right. that it happens to anybody. And, and, that, that, that these, and these people are dead right now. They you are. There's a lot of people in my family are dead. You can't, hold on. You can't say sorry to these people for what your people did to them, right? Your I nation know, did to them. I'm hold on, let me finish. Show. Let me finish, Peter. Wait, don't all touch right, me. Don't touch me. Show. I'm going to have a good time. You guys, you guys. Peter, 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 Peter. I'm going to tell you why. You can't hold things with remorse and even people. That's why I trust you are the devil that the Bible splits up. That's right! You know, you try to talk to these people. You try to deal with them. But then you realize, you look into their eyes, and you understand that these people are the devil that the Bible speaks of. Oh, That's what white people are today, God. man. They are the devil. They cannot feel remorse, man. They can't feel empathy for black and Hispanic people, man. Because they don't give a damn about black and Hispanic people, man. Oh,
I pray to y'all that one day my people see them chariots Spreading the word in them streets for my people not hearing us I pray that we make it through the fire This word gon' take us